Closer and closer comes the high school football season, and in tonight's preview, we go to Fillmore Central Falcons, who look to be poised to be contenders in the Mid-Southeast Blue Conference, with nearly their entire roster back and a take-care-of-business mindset. Falcons football is ready to go all out in 2022. After only losing just four players from a year ago, the squad and the community have strong expectations for this season. Well, I think this team has a lot of confidence because they did they did finish the season last year at the section final. Uh, but like we've talked about last year, success does not predict anything this year. They got to go out and earn everything. And, and I think our kids took that to heart and had a great off season and a great summer. Once again, leaning on a strong rushing offense, the Falcons have Bryce Corson back for one last year. And he's looking to get bulkier as the season progresses to complement his quick speed. I definitely think I need to get bigger, get, be able to break some more tackles. I, I think I'm fast enough, but now I just need to get, be able to run through some people because, you know, we're a quick offense. We run the ball a lot, quick to quick. The snaps are right back, right back to back, so, yeah. Defensively, it's going to take the same kind of consistency that nearly got the Falcons to state a year ago. The team has a gritty schedule that includes a rematch against Rushford Peterson on September 9th. Ben, I mean, even the, like two years ago when we met him in the section championship, that was a close game, and... Last year was a close game in the section finals, and we're obviously, yeah, it's a goal of ours to get back there, and it's going to be fun. The goal is still the same for the Falcons. While the gang is practically all still here, every team in their way must be taken just as seriously as the next. How high the Falcons fly doesn't hinge on the strength in numbers, but what they do with those numbers. They don't have big egos. They, uh... They know that they have areas that they can improve on. They're just a great group of kids to be around. You can have fun with them. They know when you want to, you can joke with them a little bit, but you can rein them right back in and they're ready to get back to work. The Falcons open up their season against Janesville Walter Pemberton at home this Friday at 7 p.m. They beat JWF last year 53-13.